All right, guys, character creation. Instantly, it just starts you off with Tom Holland as your character, basic voice. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. That's not a little too high pitch for me. You can change the pitch down. Wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. That sounds so metallic. You hear that? I have to choose this voice. As me, as someone who's a musician and can hear this kind of stuff, it would annoy me throughout the whole game. This like sounds like to me, it's like a human. It's almost sounds like a like a like a geth from Mass Effect. It's almost what it sounds like. Shepard Commander. Name your character to proceed. <laughs> Kevin. Cool X. <laughs> oh shit! Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Oh, I'll show you some wand work, baby. I mean, what? Dude, look at Elazar, man. This guy's got hops. Dude, if I was at that age and I can climb a ledge like this, I'd be very happy with how my life went. Reparo! Dude, that looks cool. That's a cool look. That's cool. I feel like having the word reparo as like the way to repair the bridge. That's less lazy Latin. Wait, I could be, I could easily be a wizard. The one nice thing this game does, you follow the NPC at the same walking speed. You don't realize how much of a quality of a life improvement that is when it comes to RPG games. Oh my God. This night underneath the mirror is like, what you doing in my waters? <laughs> Plus 10 points if you guys know without that reference. Yeah, we're trying bare leaves for my shoe. Uh, sir? They have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. No, not him, dude. He's good. Oh, you're not supposed to shoot the no. messenger. Well, Ranrock don't give a well, F. This guy got a big ass sword and can't hit anything with it. Come on, man. It's like, oh, you too. Ugh. Dude, this guy's literally a stormtrooper with a sword. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh, we got a sorting ceremony. You know where we're going. Dude, why does that kid look so terrified? <laughs> like running away from there, like, like, oh God, what did I get sorted into? Perhaps you belong in Hufflepuff. Oh, yeah, baby, we're going to be a puff. Yeah, you best be believing it. I'm accepting that sword mint right there. We about to puff it up in this bish. Accept. Man, this is really disheartening having this many frames going on. Dude, what is going on with my game? Now, here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff common room. I like how like the Hufflepuffs are good. They, they get shunned into the, the wine cellar, basically. I'm just like low key kind of upset at where they place the Hufflepuff people, just like in the basement. <laughs> like, come on, man, can we get a view? You have plenty of windows. There we go. This is our living quarters here. I'm liking this. The pot, yeah, even though we're living in the basement, I think we're living pretty good. Now, if this was cyberpunk, I would think that was a glitch, but I actually think that's part of the game. Welcome to Hufflepuff, by the way. Really glad to have you in our house. I'm Arthur. No, I gotta be real, that's not an actual voice. Like, that's someone, like, trying to be a character. Like, there's no way that's, like, someone's actual voice. What? No. You gotta have a pet, man. At least a dog or something. Come on. Nifflers, glumbumbles, bow truckles. I thought they were only pigeons. <laughs> In that voice, hearing those words, it's like, it just sounds extra nerdy. <laughs> but look how shitty this wall looks. Like, dude, the Hufflepuff's got the shaft in all the house rooms. Like, I don't know what they all look like, but I guarantee you they look better than this. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Weasley, we just met and you're trying to get the dirt on me right now? Like, come on. You're trying to get me to spill some tea? I already drank like five cups from other people's tea. You're trying to get me to spill some? It ain't happening, girl. I'm sorry. What the hell are you doing? Is a dude just throwing flame like torches? <laughs> and he's also psychotic. Okay. You gonna pick those up, dude? Or are you just gonna... Okay, you're just gonna you're just gonna you're just gonna do that and leave your mess behind. Okay. Well, clearly he's a Slytherin for just like only thinking for himself and not cleaning up his mess. Alright, well, that's cool. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now I Take it on Sebastian, you're about to get for wrecked, kid. Oh god. Hey. The red kid. Take it, Sebastian! Get ready for this. 
Hash these freaking hands, kid. That's right. You bow it down to a true master. Fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Sebastian's like leaning in, like, trying to do some shady shit, like on the DL. I got you, dog. Sounds suspicious. As a Hufflepuff, yes. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned. This guy's absolutely the drug dealer at Hogwarts. Sebastian over here is like, I can show you some real Hufflepuff if you know what I'm talking about. It's a cat! <gasps> can you pet the cat, please? Yes, you can pet the cat! How's this game not a 10 out of 10? Oh god, I just busted into the bathrooms here. Oh, wait, no, what is going on with this game? I can actually use this? No. Oh, okay, I can just flush. I was like, oh God. Oh my God, this thing is... Okay, maybe not that one. Dude, someone's gotta fix that toilet, dude. Like that's, that's not re regulation. Well, the water bill's gonna be high this month at Hogwarts. <laughs> okay, so let me in both bathrooms. There's no way that these are, I'm allowed in either one of these, unless Hogwarts is gender neutral. Kidding on me or something? What the hell is someone... What is someone doing in the bathroom, dude? What is this? Dude, if I went into a bathroom stall and saw this, I would be freaking out. Like, what is going on in here? <laughs> what? <laughs> Making crack. <laughs> Something like that. All right, Natty, you and I, 1v1. Summoner's Corp, bring it on, girl. Let's see what you got. Oh, bringing up the 30. Well, watch, watch a little bit of this. Akio, baby! Oh, you're gonna get absolutely disappointed. Maybe me as well, because I was 30. God damn it. Oh, she got 50? Okay. Akio! Get your ball. Oh, no. Uh, she's gonna have to choke on this one. Oh, I don't know if I can mathematically do it now. No, if I get 50 on this one, then it will tie. So this one has to be perfect. No, uh. no, try not to be nervous. You are doing quite well. Wow, thanks, Nadia. Yeah, just don't, yeah, don't be nervous, but you just have to land this one absolutely perfect. Just the tie. Okay. All right, let's go. Akio! That's a little hot. Uh, okay, we got the 50. There we go. We tied it up. I'll take it. A seasoned veteran versus a novice rookie like me. I'll take a, I'll take a tie. Oh, you got the moving boxes in this now. Oh, she just pulled out the right time right there. Dodge the boxes right at 30. All right. Not too bad. Akio! Shit! Oh, no! Slow down! Please don't roll anymore! There we go. Bam! 50, girl. Catch up. Oh, she's playing it safe with another 30. Okay. Yeah, I can applaud that, but I'm saying go big or go home, girl. I'll take it. Oh, she got wrecked by the box. All I need is 10 points. Like, all I need to do is get to, like, the orange and she's done. No, I don't want you. No. Yeah. There we go. Get those dubs. Mmm, baby. Kevin wins summon her court. Iron difficulty, baby. Oh, please go away, dude. I'm late for class. I gotta go. Right. Ripero. Nicely done. Works like a charm. No one, how come no one else has thought about doing that? I just like that special work. I'm like, yeah. Learned it two seconds ago. I repaired the statue has been broken for 50 years. I guess I'm just, I'm just that special. 